You know, that documentary last night was actually better than I thought it would be. Really? Should have been about Samuel Morse, the way they telegraphed that ending. You know, I already pretended to laugh at that joke once. Do I have to do it again? <laughs> yeah, I'd appreciate it. <laughs> Oh, oh, Samuel Morse, you kill me. <laughs> Leonard, can you drive me to work? Yeah, sure. Oh, hey, the guys and I were talking about going to see the Tesla coil at the observatory later on, if you want to join. Oh, I'm sorry I can't. I'm busy. Oh, what are you doing? Leonard, what, what are you doing? You said you can't go. Make a sad face. Move on. <laughs> it's fine. I couldn't tell you even if I wanted to. What does that mean? Leonard, sad face, sad face. <laughs> I mean, I would like to, but I, I just can't, you know, because it's classified and top secret. Hold on, are you still working for the military? I am so glad you figured that out. It was killing me keeping it a secret. I thought they fired you guys. They did, but then they hired me back. Well, you better not be working on our project because we're a team. Leonard, there is no I in team. <laughs> However, there is an I in I'm working with the military and you're not. <laughs> There's five of them, in fact. Why would the military want Sheldon? I don't know. Target practice? <laughs> well, he better not be working on our guidance system. That was my idea. Why don't we call Colonel Williams and find out what's going on? Great. I want answers, and he better give them to us. Hello, gentlemen. Hi, sir. Um, Leonard has a question. <laughs> hey, is Sheldon working on our project again? Did he say that? No, he wouldn't tell us. Oh. So we can keep his mouth shut. <laughs> How do I get him to do that? Is he working on our guidance system or not? Dr. Cooper contacted us with an idea on how to modify your technology into a communication system, and it seemed interesting. But our team developed that technology. And he was your team leader. Well, who said he was team leader? He did. <laughs> And I like that kind of take-charge attitude. We can have take-charge attitudes. Then why didn't either of you ask to be team leader? We didn't want to step on anyone's toes. <laughs> yeah, so we were just waiting for you to tell us who you thought... To... Okay, I hear it. Are we done? No, no, I am taking charge right now and telling you that it is not okay with oh, us. Yeah. If... Okay, fine. <laughs> What do you want to watch? Oh, why don't you pick? Okay, how about comedy? Eh, I already laughed today. <laughs> I know, it was when I stubbed my toe. <laughs> Still funny. <laughs> Drama? Nah, I've already seen someone cry today. It really hurt, Sheldon. <laughs> hey. We talked to Colonel Williams. He told us everything. Uh, so can, can we do this another time? Amy's just about to realize she wants to watch a Hulk marathon. <laughs> What's going on? Sheldon went to the Air Force behind our backs. I did nothing of the sort. I had an idea for a neutrino-based communication system. I presented it to them, and they were interested. But your, your communication system was based on our guidance system. And sonar is based on bats. You don't see them hanging upside down in a patent attorney's office. You know what? You like to think that you're just like Tesla, but the truth is you're exactly like Edison. You take that back. No, he's right. You are a bully, a credit hog, and a self-promoter. And if anyone around here is like Tesla, it's us. Yeah. <laughs> Can you believe they said I was just like Edison? Getting in front of a lady, no less. Well, you are building on their work and taking the credit for it. That's a classic Edison move. Oh, yeah? Well, if I'm Edison and you love me, then what does that say about you? I honestly don't know. Okay, well, I have to Google some stuff about Mrs. Edison. I'll be right back. 